Hi and welcome to this quick guide on how to install Rayman Expert and play it. Uh, I'll be using the GOG and Rayman control panel way because for me that's the easiest. So I'm gonna explain you and run you through it. First of all, you're gonna be downloading the Rayman Forever game through GOG Galaxy uh, and install it that way. So once that's installed, that is uh, good to go. Then in the video description, there's also gonna be three links that you're gonna have to be downloading. So first of all, the latest version of Rayman Control Panel, the rayxp.rar file, which is actually the ROM hack, and also the dosbox rayman underscore single dot conf. So once you have all those files, uh, you're gonna be going to the Rayman Forever folder, uh, which is located in the program files GOG Galaxy Games Rayman Forever and you're gonna be extracting the rayxp.rar You're gonna be extracting that in the folder of Rayman Forever, right? For me, it's already there, but you have to uh, place it there, right? Then uh, you've also downloaded the, the uh, conf file. You replace the one also from the Rayman Forever folder with that. And once that all set up, then you're good to go to launch the Rayman control panel. So go ahead and do that. Then you're going to be clicking the plus button over here at the bottom. You're going to be pressing the locate button here. And then you're going to go to the GOG Galaxy folder again, the games folder and the Rayman Forever folder. And you're going to be selecting the Ray XP folder. So then click select folder. Right, now you can um, cross out of that. And then uh, it still says Rayman, but you can just click on it and then press the F2 key on your keyboard and then name it whatever you want. So I'll name it Expert V2 because I already have one uh, up there, right? And then you see the name change. And then you go to the settings right here or the options rather. You're going to be clicking the use recommended settings button. Um, then in the DOSBox settings, you can change the resolution. So if you want a windowed resolution on a full screen resolution, you can change that here. I uh, set it to 1280 by 800 myself. Then you can uh, actually, it's recommended to change the frame skip to zero. And then if you scroll down, you change the cycles to 29,000. And once you've done that, you press the save button, right? Also, uh, yeah, there is a toggle here in DOSBox uh, for full screen or no full screen, right? So um, if you don't want full screen, leave that box empty. Right. So after that, you are kind of good to go. But uh, I, uh, for one, wanted to play on a controller and binding the keys was a problem for me. So what I had to do, which you might not even have to do, is you open up that DOSBox Rayman.conf file with a notepad like that and then you can control F so to search it and then you're gonna be pressing joystick right and then it uh, shows you the joystick options and what you're gonna be doing is uh, changing the joystick type to none for you that will say something else I had to change that to none otherwise my controller wouldn't work properly so once again you might not have to do this but I had to do that so now also to get the controller working, I use joy to key uh, with the following setup. So I've bound all the D-pad uh, with the arrow keys. And then you have to bind the jump, punch and action key with control left alt and X. Uh, and then I also bounded the enter key. I put that one on triangle myself. And then I put the escape on start and I put select for pause. Uh, apart from that, ignore this one. This is just for splitting uh, in live split. So that's how I uh, play the game. So if you've done all that and you press play the game, the game will open in windowed mode on the resolution you wanted and it will launch and it will be uh, ready for takeoff. So enjoy playing the game everyone, I've been having a blast as I said, new videos of my playthrough will be uploaded in the next weeks, so uh, stay tuned for that, thank you very much for watching the video, and I'll see you in the next one, bye bye!